You know, that would be, in all seriousness, that'd be a nice team for the Big Ten to pick up, though. Pitt's a quality, historically a quality football program. They feel more Midwestern than ACC-ish, mm. location-wise. Mm. I, I would like, you know, hey, they picked up Rutgers, and that adds nothing to Well, the they were trying to pick up the New York market. <laughs> Which is not Rutgers. <laughs> yeah. First of all, the New York market doesn't care about college football. No. But I loved it when they're like, yeah, we're expanding. You know, we're going to get uh, Rutgers, and uh, we'll own the uh, New York uh, metropolitan area. I go, no, you won't. Well, there's not much else for football yeah. in the area. So, yeah. I mean, I'd rather talk or go see Army football. Uh Boston College has a little bit more notoriety. Syracuse, I guess. Not Rutgers. No. What was that, a Thursday night game on the mothership many, many years ago when Rutgers won? And uh, did they beat the – who did they beat? Oh, it was like the Greg Schiano Bowl, the big one. But but it was it was at Rutgers on a like a Thursday night on the mothership. Did they win on a field goal? I – I just Ito? Re- Ito was the kicker, I think? Yeah, maybe. Judge Ito. Yeah, I think he was he, there. He went on to, you know, handle the OJ trial. Yes. That so. was that whole keep on chopping era that got all oh, crazy. Yeah. That <laughs> yeah, keep on chopping. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's the best. Scarlet fever, man. Yeah. Catch it. Rutgers football. Hmm. Yeah, more. Also, did you guys see Miami? No more turnover change. Yeah, I saw that. Come on, new year, new us. Fill the sleeves. Okay, but I have a problem with, uh, by the way, we love the strength and conditioning coach, the uh, fill the sleeves guy. What's his name, Paulie? Coach Aaron Feld. He's the strength coach. Yeah, we like him. The Hurricanes. Fill the sleeves. Used to be at Oregon. Yeah, Paulie. Rutgers 2006 beat Louisville 28-25. That was a big one. That That was on. Was that on the mothership? Had to be if it's Rutgers. Yeah, 06. And and was how high ha- ranked was Louisville? Like there was some some magnitude to it. Like oh my God, Rutgers just did this. But I don't I don't I remember doing Sports Center, but I don't I don't know. I got Rutgers beating Maryland in 2014 in a burner. Yeah. Yes, Todd. They're Piscata way better than you're giving them credit for. You just don't remember mm, some of these big. Uh, They're more New Brunswick I, we, anyway. No, no we can't go into the weekend like that. We got we got fifteen minutes to clean that up. Mm-hmm. Yeah, more. Louisville was ranked number three. Okay, that maybe year. okay, maybe that's what it was. And Jeremy Ito, forty six year old field goal, nice I call. Said, oh, <laughs> bloop, 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 bloop. Nice job. A deep pull. Nice. <laughs> Louisville had your boy Brian Brown at quarterback. Oh yeah, good quarterback. Didn't he go to Purdue? He's a head coach there. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Brian Brom, the Brom brothers. Rutgers had uh, Ray Rice and a good defense. Well, didn't they have the other running back? Didn't they have Ray Rice and then there was a white running back who rushed for like a thousand yards? Brian Leonard. Brian. Brian Leonard. Brian Leonard? Right? I know my white running Blue? backs. Blue? Don't, don't test <laughs> me on this. Lightning? What? <laughs> Thunder and Whitening. It was actually oh! called. Paulie gets, Paulie gets meat Friday first. Yes. We're going to take a break. Back after this.